On August 11th, I witnessed this large tornadic supercell near Clifton, Wisconsin. Conditions were not ideal for close tornado spotting, so I opted for a more elevated view with my drone. It was nearly impossible to see at the time, however, I captured a large tornado. The chase on this day started right as I hit the road. An early morning MCS brought strong winds, rain, and lightning to the Chicago area. In Wisconsin, the environment was primed for tornadic supercells, where the SPC had placed a large 10% area for tornadoes. The air was so humid that the visibility was basically zero. However, a strong velocity couplet and correlation coefficient drop made me confident a tornado was in progress. Right around this time, the storm would be doing something that would stump even Cameron Nixon. Radar would show an anticyclonic rotation at the center of a normal cyclonic mesocyclone. This first clip is in real time. You can see the tornado right at the center. On the left is the RFD, and on the right is the forward flank. The circulation becomes much more evident when I speed up the footage. Notice how all the low-level air is being drawn towards the forward flank of the storm. Also, you can see the low-level air rises like a reverse waterfall, being sucked up by the storm's updraft. I think the most interesting thing is that the low-level air appears to be stretching into vortices. This is consistent with Dr. Lee Orff's simulations. Here, I've zoomed into where the tornado was. I would fall behind the storm because of poor road conditions. Later in the day, I would see this ground scraping mesocyclone. This thing was not tornadic. The last storm I would track on this day was near Mineral Point, Wisconsin. I would have this brief view of a funnel cloud in the distance. Oh. Right around this time, other chasers would capture what seems to be a tornadic sonic boom. This may be the first solid evidence of tornadoes producing supersonic wind speeds. That's pretty incredible. So I think I got a wedge on drone video today. That's absolutely insane. There was a CC drop. Um, on the radar so there definitely was debris being lofted um, and to celebrate that's what I'm talking about ooh. Uh, ooh. Mm. oh oh yeah cover is good mm. I'm gonna be taking the weekend off and driving down to Tucson, Arizona to hopefully get some monsoon chasing going. But I am hoping for some good lightning, which kind of has been lacking for me this year. Um, peace.